Yeah, it is raising awareness about organ transplant this Donate a Life month. Since 1963, Barnes Jewish Hospital has transplanted more than 13,000 organs. Last year, it was ranked 15th in the nation for transplant volume. Dr. Jason Wellen is the Kidney and Pancreas Transplant Surgical Director at the Washington and Barnes Jewish Transplant Center, and he's here with us this morning to talk more about this. Good morning. Good morning. How are yeah, you? Very good. Thank you. So tell us about the 50th anniversary and also this prestigious national ranking. Yeah, we're very proud of that. Mm -hmm. At Washington University Barnes Jewish Transplant Center, we performed over 13,000 transplants over that time. Uh, it takes a lot of people moving all over the country, different parts to get people uh, transplanted. Yeah. And so we've hit record numbers of organs this past year and the year before. So we're very proud of our, of our outcomes. Yeah. We were just talking that you are seeing more people being willing to donate. And maybe we could even see more of some myths uh, are out there about whether you should donate or not. And one of those is, is it going to cost me to donate an organ? Yeah, a lot of people wonder that. You know, yeah. They don't want to pay the expense. But what's interesting is if you're a living donor mm -hmm. and you get cleared by our transplant center, all of your medical costs are covered by the recipient's insurance. So you should have no medical costs uh, to be a living donor for an organ. Yeah, second is, hey, it's on my driver's license. I told him I would donate an organ, so I'm good, right? I don't have to do anything else. Sure, it's definitely very important, right? To put mm -hmm. that on the back of your license, if that's your wish. But it really shouldn't stop there. Uh, having a good conversation with your family about what your wishes are is extremely important if, God forbid, anything should happen to you. Yeah, myth number three is, you know, I, I would donate, but no one in my family needs it right now. Right, and so the truth is we have over 800 people at Barnes-Jewish Washington University Transplant mm -hmm. Center waiting for a kidney. Uh, many of them are children that are waiting upwards of three years for, for organs. So even if it's not someone in your family, there's tons and hundreds of people whose lives you can save uh, if you're interested. Yeah, and the fourth and final one is, you know, I'm just too sick, I'm too old, no one's going to want my organs or tissue. Yeah, people think that. They yeah. think, oh, I'm too old to be a donor. Mm -hmm. And it's really not always the case. Uh, age is just a number these days. And so if you're interested or anyone's interested, I would say just call the transplant center. Um, there's also other ways to donate, like tissue mm -hmm. um, that are available to people as well. Absolutely. Dr. Jason Wellen, thank you so much for your time this morning. Congratulations to you. Thank you very much. Absolutely. We'll provide more information as well on our website, fox2now.com. All right, 720 on the clock. We're going to toss things out to Tim.